Here are five reasons why you should get a dock for your Steam Deck. Come here, Mr. Engaged. Number one, it allows you to easily connect to a TV or monitor so that you can play on a bigger screen. Look, we all know seven inches is a lot, but what if you need a little bit bigger? Number two, the Steam Deck only has one port. I guess it has two if you count the headphone jack, but I'm not really counting that. So if you wanna do anything other than just plugging your Steam Deck into power, you're going to need some sort of a dongle. And the dock is basically just a tailor-made dongle specifically for the Steam Deck. That way you can charge your Steam Deck while still having more ports available. Number three, the dock gives you access to ethernet. As any gamer knows, Wi-Fi can be... <laughs> We'll say spotty at best, and if you really want a game, Ethernet is the way to go. It'll give you faster internet speeds, and more importantly, it's more reliable than Wi-Fi. So if you're really wanting to get some gaming in, Ethernet is the way to go. Number four, it gives you three USB-A ports, which you can plug in mice or keyboards or hard drives or thumbsticks or whatever you want. You have three extra USB-A ports to do it. It's super convenient, and especially if you're someone like me and you like to use your Steam Deck as a PC sometimes, especially when you're messing around in your file browser or setting up emulators or whatever you're doing it's just easier to do with the mouse and keyboard and having a dock allows you to with one cable you basically are plugging in your mouse keyboard monitor and charging all at the same time and all in one simple package number five and this one might sound silly but it's actually probably my favorite part about the dock is that it gives the steam deck a home where it can live and then you know where to find it for me before i got a dock i was always just setting the steam deck around somewhere and then when i wanted to play it next i couldn't find it and then when i did find it it wouldn't be charged but now that I have a Steam Deck dock, I know when I'm done playing it, I put it back on the dock and I plug it in. And then I know the next time I go to play, it's going to be fully charged and it's going to be right where I know it's supposed to be. For me, that's actually a big deal is having a home for it to go. And as a little bonus, it just looks nice sitting on your desk. So that way it's not laying flat. You can see the screen. You can have it propped up at a nice angle if you want to use the Steam Deck screen and it just looks more presentable than it does when you just lay it down flat without a dock. Full transparency, while this dock was sent over by the company Kiwi Home who makes it, they haven't paid me any money and they don't get to see this review before it comes out. And these are all just my honest opinions about having a Steam Deck dock. And one really nice feature I like about this dock specifically is that it has a button on the back, which when you press it, it basically powers everything off. So if for whatever reason you wanted everything to be disconnected from your Steam Deck or from the dock, you can just press that button instead of unplugging everything. And it just makes things a little bit easier. But that's just my opinion. I'm curious about you guys. Do you use a Steam Deck dock with your Steam Deck? or do you guys just use a dongle or not use anything at all and just don't plug it up to TVs or monitors or whatever? Let me know in the comment section below what your personal Steam Deck setup looks like. All right, we're gonna leave things there. See you guys next time. Peace.